The first thing you need to do is to log in into your Facebook account or create one. If you don't already have one, you can use your personal Facebook account for this if you want, because your ads are in no way linked to your name. They will be linked to your Facebook fan page, if anything. It's highly recommended you do all your work with Facebook ads on a desktop, computer, or laptop, not on a mobile device. If you don't have a desktop or laptop, see if you can borrow one or use one at the library or internet cafe. The dashboard is buggy at times on mobile. To get to your dashboard, click the small arrow on the top right of your Facebook profile to bring out the drop down menu and click on Manage Ads. You can also try type in the URL if you cannot find this option easily. Just click Facebook.com ads. If you're using an ad blocker, they will ask you to turn it off and add the web page to your exception list. Once this is done, you should refresh the page. You may find this dashboard a little confusing at first. There are a lot of available options, and sometimes they can seem a little redundant. The same information may appear in multiple locations. Take a little time to familiar yourself with the dashboard before jump into an creation. And we will notice there's a guided creation mode that will help get you through the process and a quick creation model for people who are a little more familiar with the Facebook ads creation process. Once you've got a hung on of the basic options, let's take a close look at the different types of ads that are currently available.